Hello dears, 5th standard social science term 3, unit 3, educational rights evaluation part. First, choose the correct answer. Question number 1, dance is the first step for a child's development. Options, education, exploration, excavation. Very good children. Education. Option A. Education. Education is the first step for a child's development. Number 2. Education is more than dash. Options are numeracy, literacy, all of the above. Education is more than all of the above. Option C. All of the above. Third question. Education is the manifestation of the perfection already in man. Is the famous quote of Dash. Options are Mahatma Gandhi, Dr. Radha Krishnan, Swami Vivekananda. Answer is option C, Swami Vivekananda. Education is the manifestation of the perfection already in man. Is the famous quote of Swami Vivekananda. Next fourth one. Das describes the importance of free and compulsory education for children. Options are the Right to Literacy Act, the Right to Education Act, the Right to School Act. Answer is option B, the Right to Education Act, the Right to Education Act. Fifth one, the Government of India has framed the Das to promote education. Options are National Education Policy, National Policy on Elementary Education, National Policy on Literacy. Answer is option A, National Education Policy, National Education Policy. Children, check your answers. Next, match the following. One side we have Guru Bulam K. Kamaraj. Right to Education Act, Education, Samakra Shiksha. Other side we have 2009-2018, Develops Wisdom, Ancient Indian Educational System, Free Midday Meal. Number 1, Guru Gulam. Guru Gulam is Ancient Indian Educational System. Ancient Indian Educational System, Guru Gulam. Guru Gulam match with Ancient Indian Educational System system. Next one K Kamaraj. K Kamaraj matches with free midday meal. Free midday meal. Second one. Next third question. Right to Educational Act. Right to Education Act is 2009. Right to Education Act matches with 2009. Education. Education matches with develops wisdom. Education develops wisdom. Fifth one. Samakara Shiksha. Samakara Shiksha matches with 2018. Samakara Shiksha 2018. Alright children, now check your answers. Next, true or false. Number 1. Every children has the right to have free and compulsory education. Every children has the right to have free and compulsory education. Yes, it is true. Number one is true. Second one, education helps in increasing awareness of surroundings, social and political issues. Education helps in increasing awareness of surroundings, social and political issues. Yes, it is true. Second one is true. Right to School Act describe the importance of free and compulsory education for children. Right to School Act. No, uh, it's wrong. Right to Education Act is correct. Right to School Act is wrong. So it is false. Third one is false. Number four, numeracy is the first step towards making one educated. Numeracy is the first step towards making one educated. No, it is false. Fourth one is false. 
the former chief minister of tamil nadu k kamaraj was implemented free mid day meal program k kamaraj was implemented free mid day meal program yes it is true now check our answers next answer the following number 1 write about the importance of education write about the importance of education children please take the page number 138 children here importance of education uh, education does not mean that one should be literate it is more than literacy education helps to analyze the re reason build skills to live know what is right and wrong lead a moral life this is first question answer next write a short note on educational rights write a short note on educational rights take the page number 139 educational rights so this two paragraph a note the second question answer note down every child has right to have free and compulsory education the right to education act rte specifies different responsibilities to the local authorities and government to ensure free and compulsory education right to education act 2009 describes the importance of free and compulsory education for children between 6 to 14 years of age this is second question answer next what is the role of sarva shiksha abhiyan what is the role of sarva shiksha abhiyan take the page number 142 142 sarva shiksha abhiyan was launched in the year 2001 increasing the enrollment in primary schools getting access to the free and compulsory education for children up to age 14 improving the quality of education this is third question and answer no don't children next fourth one give a short note on national educational policy page number 141 national education policy nep in 2019 the government of india has framed the national education policy nep to promote education among the people of india the nep covers all educational systems from primary to college level this is fourth question answer next fifth one write any two features of samakra shiksha take the page number 143 uh, supporting all state governments in implementing rte focusing on girl education focusing on digital education this is fifth question answer next answer in detail first one write about the indian education system write about the indian education system answer in ancient india the gurukul system of education was practiced the british who ruled over our country brought in reforms in education now we have an improved system of education after independence in 2019 the government of india has framed the national education policy we hope that it will bring about welcome changes in our education the second question write about the right to education act in detail write about the right to education act in detail 141 importance features of rte uh, these five points you note down children this is second detail question answer next write about samakra shiksha in detail write about samakra shiksha in detail 143 later in 2018 the government of india wanted to provide a single scheme for school education starting from preschool to class 12 this scheme is known as samakra shiksha objectives of samakra shiksha providing quality education and improving learning outcomes of students supporting all state government in implementing rte focusing on girl education focusing on digital education in the past two decades india has achieved a maximum enrollment of students in schools this is third question answer okay children i hope you all have noted down the correct answers thank you happy learning